literally anime women is the best and the number one thing I want to point out why anime women is better is because um, their personality hey you guys it's me alone the guy 995 back in again with another discussion video now disclaimer just gonna let you know I'm recording this outside so you might hear a lot of cars or airplanes or or wind blowing so just want to get that out of the way I'm recording this voice footage outside and also if it seemed like I'm like you could hear that I'm breathing kind of funny it's because I've been drinking too much energy drink so I have to take a break from drinking caffeine for like two or three weeks but I end up breaking that rule by drinking some coffee today so now after I drunk a coffee iced coffee now i'm having some breathing issues i'm having chest pains so i have to, after this i'm just gonna have to take a two week or three week break from caffeine and so i feel like i'm in a good condition to drink some so yeah i'm having a hard time breathing drinking caffeine so yeah so just bear just bear with me on talking throughout this video trying to like breathe um, very clearly but yeah anyway this video is about my response video on why 2d women is better than real women now there's some lies and truths in that video but before we get into that I want to just say I don't want anybody who watching that video take anything personal watching that video the whole point was to make that video was to like make it for entertainment purpose and also to like to encourage anybody well i don't know if i should say encourage but just get part of what i be feeling sometimes out to any other people who relate basically just reunite reunite any other guys who could relate to me doing in that video so that's the whole point of making it for entertainment purpose and also like bring together to anybody who could relate so they don't have to feel down about what they're doing or or feeling down about doing something about what they love about like playing hentai games or playing romance visual novel games so they don't feel down about it because sometimes real life sucks you you're not going to be able to get the girl you want but yeah moving on you don't want to drag that out but as I was saying there was some lies and truths in that video now let's cover the lies now the lies is I wouldn't say 100% anime women is better than real women because there are certain moments where when I'm out and about going shopping my anime whether it be anime clothes or anything like every single time I look at uh, like there could be like a beautiful beautiful Mexican women like of course I have some thoughts saying man I wish I could go out with her I wish I could, she could be mine and I just check her out look at her butt look at her boobs I mean typical guy stuff because we're guys we can't control our hormones but yeah I'll be I'll be doing that I mean I can't help it I'm a guy but that was some lies in that statement what I made about anime women being, being better than real women like there's certain like the real women i mean the legit legit what i really want legitimately is a japanese woman and i know i'm never in my life gonna get that because where i live at and then plus plus i need to be able to go to japan to get what i want but certain circumstances i won't be able to do that so there might be some of you guys who literally go out and about like guys that's introvert like me go out and about just to do shopping i mean or just to get some anime stuff and then you go out and about and you see couples and you see just girls walking and then you just feel jealous and just like powerless that you can't do anything now don't get me wrong I'm just gonna tell the truth. I'd be looking at um, the women. I mean, of course, nothing to be afraid of admitting because we all mostly do it. And then um, 
I also tried to get some phone numbers for some women. And then, of course, it's obviously always in the rejection. Like, it just sucks. So, now, what made me feel like, what made me want to put out that video, that first video, the reason why is because it's just in the same situation on why I'm putting up this video. So, basically, the reason why, so, basically, I'm going to give you the reason why I'm, I put out the first video. Well, I would say a second reason, a second reason and uh, putting out the first video and then a reason to putting out this first bit. I mean, the second video. OK, see, I need to calm down. All right. So what I'm trying to say is I'm going to give you another reason why I'm putting out the first video. What I put up. You blew it. All right. Calm down. What I'm trying to say is that the reason why I put out the first video I'm going to explain it and then another reason why I'm putting out this video. Now, the reason why I'm putting out both, why I put out both videos is because after going outside, obviously shopping and seeing couples and seeing girls that I can't attain, I mean, seeing couples about being jealous, of course, and then seeing girls I can't attain, I end up jumping on, um, uh, romance anti visual novel game, usually what you other guys be doing. So, honestly, not surprised. Like, like the mindset that I get when I see a girl that I can't obtain and see couples jealousy, jealousy starts to take over, and then I start getting to the point where I haven't thoughts like, man, I wish I could be that fucking guy. Like, I'd be having that thoughts. I get jealous when I see a beautiful girl I can't attain or a, a girl that's my type that I can't attain. And then when I see couples, I, I start that get jealous and just saying, I wish I was that guy. So what make, so how do I deal with that situation? So after I keep getting that situation, I mean, getting that constant thoughts back and back and forth, what I do and how I handle that situation is go home, stay in the house, don't want to look at like don't want to go outside seeing any other girls or couples because i'm an introvert obviously and i just boot up a romance hentai visual novel game and then the recent one i just played which was very recently i had three days off this week um on i would say after thanksgiving so i would say basically friday i just played making lovers making lovers and had the hentai patch installed and i was on i was on the aqua um route aqua route non-blood related little sister i was on her route and man the whole romance and then the whole sex scenes and everything in that whole route was so was so wholesome as whole i mean <laughs> Oh, man, man, that was so bad. Well, it was so wholesome is what I meant to say. It was really so wholesome as a whole. That's what I was trying to say. But, yeah, and then after doing, like, one sex scene and then two sex scenes, I mean, of course, we got the romance stuff first. Then it transitioned to the first sex scene and then the two sex scene. And then after like just sinking all that content into my head, it just gets me to the point where I'm like, man, I just wish, I just fucking wish that I could experience this in real life. Like this type of romance. Like when I get that feeling, that's what I, that's what made me make the first video. So basically, going out, working, or shopping, either or, seeing girls that's my type that I can't obtain, and seeing a couple being jealous, and then wishing I was that guy. Seeing, do, dealing with that all the time when I'm going out for work or shopping, like I just, I just can't. It hits the, it, my, my depression starts kicking in. And how do I fix my depression? I go home, 
lock myself in my room and then play a freaking romance visual novel game and then if the romance visual novel is wholesome as hell and the story is good and then plus the sex scenes all that sink that into my head it makes me feel that way so that's the reason why i made that video now the very truth the very truth is everything that i said about all the anime women in that video it's true it's true now i know you guys are going to be confused saying okay so which is the which is the truth then it's just that i would say basically it's the the whole thing is just complicated like i both like real women and then like anime women at the same time so that's the boat basically that's the truth but it's just that i see myself i can't attain the girl that i want so if i can't obtain it i'm just gonna say fuck it i'm just gonna go focus on romance um hentai visual novel game so that's literally what my situation is right now and honestly man i just feel like us introverts shouldn't have to go through this if i have something to blame i would just blame this world in general and then also how this works granted who knows that it could just be where i live at the reason why i had to go through this it might be different other states or stuff because i like getting romance out in california and like the los angeles area it's just not it it's just not it like i'm struggling like i'm 20 20 not, no 28 years old still single never dated and it's just so freaking hard man i just wish i had a girlfriend but it's just impossible like i already told you guys i tried and i just kept getting rejected like i'm just at a point where i just given up and just wanted to focus on anime women so that's my whole feelings about that whole video and my whole feelings as a whole so yes the lie was the lie was i don't think real i mean anime women is better than real women i don't think that's true it's just it's just that i like both truth is i like both but if i can't obtain a girlfriend in real life of course i'm gonna just run away to my romance visual novel it, since i can't get that romance in real life does that make sense? Well, yeah, that's that's basically the update and the whole response to that video. Man, it just sucks. Hopefully, 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 things will be different if I move out of the state, out of California. Hell, I probably get different results, but right now, currently, honestly, as an introvert, I go out more than any other normal introvert if I would say and that's no excuse I should be getting some I should be like getting a girlfriend but honestly I'm not getting any so it's just a stressful um, situation but all my all my introverts out there be strong just be strong just do your own thing and i hate this saying i really do it just just hope that the girls come to you just hope and pray that they come to you that's the only thing i could say at, at this point because trying trying could just go fuck right off because i already been there done that rejection is a bitch because if you get rejected your rejection you're gonna just hit a hard depression state especially if you're an introvert and rejection is a powerful thing among us sensitive types of introverts man see like right now i'm already getting depressed talking about real life relationships and girls like right now i'm already starting to get depressed it makes me just want to go boot up another romance hentai visual novel game and feel and have my heart flutter and then get goosebumps and then have a like 
beautiful i mean like have a really wonderful smile man it's just it's just man like i'm just lost of words like i am grateful from the japanese developers outside of japan i mean out in japan i mean i don't know why it's outside out in japan for giving us us western people these romance visual novels out here because granted there's a lot of japanese introvert guys that feels the same way we do but honestly i think the japanese guys in japan has a higher chance to get a girlfriend easily because how nice and innocent and sweet japanese girls is honestly if i was if if i was on their shoes i would at least try but who knows it could be it could be the same out there as it is out here who knows i really don't know i'm like i'm blind of what's going on out in japan sometimes when it comes to romance stuff and then dating marriage yada 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 i don't really know what's going on so i can't just assume that things are better out there but all i know is if i ever get like free tickets to go to japan i'm literally gonna keep myself there i'm literally gonna keep myself there i'm gonna stay out there i don't want to be here in california i want to be in japan hell i might land a japanese girlfriend for sure well a girlfriend in general out there instead of out here but man it just sucks man but yeah sorry my introverts i'm sorry man just tough it out if you feel like like i said if you feel like me go play go play a romance visual novel um just do you and if you have to go out i mean just go outside more i mean that's gonna be kind of hard task but only go outside when you have no choice but try your best to like do it more by going shopping or working and hell hopefully pray to the gods that we actually get a girlfriend honestly i don't even think praying works but that's the only thing i could say because rejection is hard i wouldn't even bother trying just just do that just do you focus on yourself and if you can't get one just play a romance hentai visual novel game and then just smile hard like that i mean just smile hard while playing one that's the best advice i could get to you guys but yeah and also for anybody who's who's interested in the game i'm referring to it's called making lovers i already just said it earlier and the route the route that i'm playing is akko akko his little non-blood related sister right now i'm i'm on the part where it's like after the second sex scene and honestly man this visual novel that i'm playing it's just it's just this this route and visual novel that i'm playing it's just really wholesome as hell man i just really love visual novel romance visual novel hentai games that's like this nothing nothing crazy i want i want to keep it vanilla as possible I want to keep it vanilla as possible. Well, I don't even I don't even know I should say that the sister, the non-blood related sister root is <laughs> vanilla, but hey, hey, hey. It's a it's a it's a it's an anime it's an anime romance fetish at this point. But whatever feelings you feel in the anime stays in anime and honestly that's how i'm treating it in real life right now so whatever fetish or real or whatever fetish or anime fetish i have i keep it in real life <laughs> oh my god i'm so tired yeah i need more sleep too but anyway corrected myself I'm not good at talking. You guys got it too. What I'm trying to say is whatever 
anime feelings or anime fetish I have stays in anime. I need to wake up. I, I just wish I could have enough. I wish I could have an energy drink, but like I told you guys, I need to stay away from the caffeine because my chest is hurting and I'm having some breathing problems drinking too much caffeine. But that's going to be it for this video. I dragged this out too long. Like I said, there was lies about me saying anime about real women. I mean, anime women being better than real women. However, the truth is I like both. But just the real women situation is kind of complicated. So I hope you guys understand. And thank you for watching this video. I'll see you guys on another discussion video.